Hi folks, Chris Voss here from thechrisvossshow.com, thechrisvossshow.com. Over the last year, I've really struggled to find a good Facebook iPad app that I could really enjoy, uh, that worked, that was stable, um, and seemed to operate well. Now, it, I, you can't blame a lot of developers, of course, they're having to deal with Facebook's changes, uh, which have been many, and uh, you know it's hard for them to do it. But I finally found one that has been stable for me for a long time, and uh, seems to work really well. And I'll show you why here. Now, the I want to show you how fast this opens. It's called MyPad for Facebook. Okay, and you can see how quickly this loads. Okay, very quick. Um, a lot of the iPad apps that are out there, they really struggle to uh, open fast and get to your data fast. So I really love how quickly. I can get the stuff. Beautiful part is here is if I want to do a post, it's integrated with Twitter. You can see here that if I want to publish something on Twitter from a post, I can do that also. So it's integrated with Twitter uh, to a certain degree. I'll show you that here in a second. The one thing I don't like about it is this uh, wasted space, the photos, and I can get into my photos fairly quickly here. One thing you'll notice is it does move quick. Uh, it's very fast compared to a lot of the, some of the other uh, Facebook iPad apps that are out there. Now you'll notice that it does work much like the Twitter uh, iPad app um, where you've got this uh, you know three-tiered thing that comes out, two-tiered thing, whatever you want to call it. Um, my messages, you can see how quickly these load. You can get your Twitter newsfeed, but uh, you can't get your mentions and your uh, direct messages, which is, uh, you know, it's not that big of a deal I live. Um, the, uh, so you can see some of the wall stream here. You can see how fast this moves. Uh, and brings in uh, data. Um, you've got your events here. Uh, the one thing I love is a lot of the um, a lot of the Facebook apps don't handle groups really well. They don't handle chat and messages really well. So uh, it, it works really well with groups, and I actively use my Empire Avenue group on here so it very quickly can get to my Empire Avenue group I can see what's going on for a long time I just used the web to get to it because I was tired of how slow it was notifications you can see how well this comes in there are chat features it's crashed on me a couple times but I am using the uh, I'm currently in the iPhone beta 5 so that may be why it's crashing is because it hasn't been developed for that product yet uh, looks like there's some games integration also um, and I, I love it. It's one of my favorite uh, iPad apps for Facebook. In fact, my number one recommend. So I feel like I can highly recommend it. The irony is Facebook will probably be launching their own iPad app fairly soon. But uh, be sure to check it out. I think it's uh, worth a couple bucks you might pay for it. It's called MyPad for Facebook. Thanks for coming by the Show.com. Be sure to check back daily.